Check out your pair. So, you were successfully able to install and run Mr. Porter's open source code Splash Party. But, we need to be able to configure this page for the actual Adidas releases. So you're going to go back to your desktop, hit go and go back to your home folder. Now in your home folder, you're going to want to find the file config.json. And you're going to open that up. So in your configure file, there's really one thing that you have to worry about, and that's this, the splash URL. Right now it is set to that practice splash page that I was talking about in the installation part of this video. What you're going to want to do is you're going to go to adidas.com slash easy. That will re redirect you to the actual easy page. You're just going to copy that link and replace it. The practice URL with the real Adidas splash page URL. Now, a lot of people are curious about all this other stuff down here, and quite frankly, you can really ignore all of it. The splash unique identifier is just a piece of code essentially on the Adidas splash page that identifies that that is a splash page in fact and not just another product page on Adidas. You can ignore this. The community will let you know that if something, if data psyche needs to be replaced. Do not change this right now. The other important thing that a lot of people are, are very confused about and that is brand new with this updated version of this script is gcookies. What gcookies will do is it will allow you to easily solve CAPTCHA when using this program in an electron. Now you do not need to change gcookies. In fact, I would not change gcookies at all. I feel like it would be easy to make a simple mistake and that will ruin the entire program. I would leave this at default. But if you really do want to change your gcookies, you can use this Google Chrome extension, edit this cookie, and that will help you get the cookies you need and be able to paste it into your configuration file. I will not go over this in this video because I do not think it is necessary and there is no need to use this extra step. I wish you all good luck on this next easy release on April 29th. Let me know in the comment comments down below if you're able to cop. Thank you guys. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button.